Reading and writing time. Learn to tell time in English. Welcome to our English language learning video on reading and writing time. In this video, we will focus on an essential skill, telling time in English. Mastering this skill will help you navigate daily life, schedule appointments, and understand time-related conversations. So, let's dive in and become confident time tellers. Before we jump into the practice activities, let's review the basics of telling time in English. In English, we use a combination of numbers and specific vocabulary to express time. The key components are 1. Hours. The hours on a clock range from 1 to 12. We use the numbers 1 through 12 to indicate the hours. 2. Minutes. Minutes are used to specify the exact time within an hour. They range from 1 to 59. 3. AM and PM. We use AM, anti-meridium, to refer to the morning hours from midnight until noon and p.m. post-meridium for the afternoon and evening hours from noon until midnight. Now that we've reviewed the basics, let's move on to some practice activities. In this section, we will focus on reading and writing time in various scenarios. By practicing these exercises, you will become more comfortable with telling time accurately. Let's begin. Exercise 1 reading analog clocks. In this exercise, you will be presented with different analog clock faces. Your task is to read and interpret the time displayed on each clock. Take your time and pay attention to both the hour and minute hands. Pause the video after each clock face is shown and write down your answer. Then, we will review the correct answers together. Exercise 2 writing digital time. Now, let's move on to writing digital time. In this exercise, you will see a series of digital time displays. Your goal is to write the time in words using the appropriate vocabulary. Remember to include the hours, minutes, and indicate whether it's AM or PM when applicable. Pause the video after each digital time display to give yourself enough time to write down your answer. Afterward, we will check the answers together. Exercise 3. Real-life scenarios. To make the learning experience more practical, let's explore real-life scenarios. I will present you with different situations, such as scheduling appointments or discussing daily routines. You will be given a description of the time and your task is to write it down in words. Practice with each scenario and then we'll go through the correct answers. Congratulations on completing the practice activities for reading and writing time in English. By practicing these exercises regularly, you will enhance your ability to tell time accurately and confidently. Remember, consistency is key when learning a new language. Keep up the good work and soon you'll be a master at telling time in English. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.